want to know how to make a YouTube video on a PS4? Well, I'm here to explain that to you. Okay, first... Come on. Uh, dang it, it's not doing it for the video. Ugh. Anyway. And I'll be getting to use my new features. When I say feature, that's just something pretty crafty I th uh, that I did. It's this. And you may think the cable is like going to like the PS4 or something. Well, watch it. Watch where the cable is. It's going into my sofa. And I did this yesterday. Got me extension cord, got me an adapter, and I plug things into there. It's pretty cool. I've been wanting it, but I just never got around to it. But now it's trying to, oh, there it is. It's trying to read my face detect. It's trying to do its face detection on me. Uh, oh, okay. There it is. Yeah. So basically, I'm just going to hit cancel on that. Now. Since you guys may think that you need PlayStation Plus to do this. See, the PlayStation Plus symbol. Yeah, you don't. Trust me. So I'm going to be doing it on my account for the P that I used on my PS3. Uh, that I used on my PS3. That's sitting marvelously right there. You can see the little red light. That's my PS4. Right there. But, um. Yeah, let's get into it. Okay. Now, you need to just go into the menu and just pick a game. Whatever you like. So, you could pick Minecraft, Destiny. Tried 4, Paragon, whatever you have. For this demonstration, I'll be doing Minecraft. And now, once you got your game loaded up, you want to press a button on your controller. It's called, it's right here. Yeah, right here. And you want to hit it twice. Yeah, you should hit it twice. Actually, never mind. Let's go to our settings first. Okay, hit settings. Okay, we want to go to... Where is it? Come on, did I pass it? Yeah, I did. Ah, sharing and broadcasting. Right there. Right there. Okay. You want to go to that. Just press X on it. And you want to make. You want to go to the very top. And you want to make sure your share button control type. See that? You want to make sure it's on standard. Length of the video clip. Usually, I think this will. I'll be on like five minutes or ten for the standard for me I use it on 15 because that's basically for a new beginner that's basically how long your videos are gonna be um so yeah you want to make sure you have these settings on I don't think you need to do all this this will come soon okay Okay, just go back to your game, whatever you had open. Again, using Minecraft for this. Ah! Uh, okay. Just hit that. And... Okay, so double tap your share button. See it? See where it says share? Okay, so you want to double tap that. And then, when you know it works, it'll come up with a little emblem. See that little... Did you see that thing in the top right? I'll do it again. 
Okay, not that. Okay, there you go. See that little thing with the red circle? That means you're recording. Just do whatever. Hello and welcome to the video. Uh, my mic's up there. I use my camera as my mic sometimes. And, um... So, since you're recording right now, you can, uh, do whatever you want. We. We. And, um, then you can end it. There's two ways you can end it. You can either double tap the share button. Again, share. You can either double tap it again. Or, you can press it once. And then I'll go and, uh, okay, it's giving a little demonstration, sort of. It's like showing it to you. Okay, share great moments. Press the share button to share your experiences in various ways. See, it says, save or upload video clips. Save or upload screenshots. Broadcast gameplay. Start share play. Post information. You want to press OK, and then again you can either double tap, double tap, press square, or you can go down and press that. But I just press, I just double tap. But you can go and you can press it once and press share, or just do that, and then hit X if you want to do like it like that. Select like that with your little joystick. Cursor, whatever you want to call it. And then he. It, it says video clip saved up there. Well, it did. And then now it's not recording. So. Then you're gonna wanna. Go. To Share Factory. Da -da! Yeah. Press it. You may have to download it. I'm not sure. Uh, well, I think you will have to download it the first time you use it. But then, of course, it'll just stay on there. So it's asking me to close the application. Of course, I will. Now I'll go into it. Come out. Go right into it. Okay. Since. Yeah, I don't have any projects. Okay, you're gonna wanna select new project. Right there. And then you're gonna press X. And then you're gonna pick a theme. So there's many to choose from. I'm just gonna go with the PlayStation theme. That's what I usually go with. Then, well, you can do that. You can either leave these in, and there's a little check beside it that'll leave it in. So yeah, I I take these all out. I don't like them. Press that. Press that. So anything with a check is gonna be in your video. So okay, now I've gotten all the checks off. Then we're gonna want to come to our actual clips right here, see? And we we want to press X on those in the order we want them to happen. So I'm gonna press X on the 11 second one, and you can see that one, see it? And then I'm gonna go over here and press two, and you can kind of see that too. Okay. Now you want to go hit square yeah square okay then you can either rename it that's what's on the left side you can either rename it or continue usually I just hit continue okay here's where you can do all the stuffs so until you really learn how to use this, you're not going to have an 
an intro. It's just not happening until you know how to use this. So basically all I'm going to do is just have this. But you can do some other things that are a bit easier to do. Oh, uh, what are you doing? Oh, baby. Like, oh, I wasn't plugging it. Okay. You can go to the end of a clip that go, like, in, and you do this if you have, like, two clips. If you go into the middle of the clip and go to the very end of the, the of the first one, or, at, like, the very start of the second one, you can press X, and it'll bring up a menu, and you can go all the way down to add transition. It's right there. Can't really see it that well. But it's there. Trust me. And you press X. And then you pick one. Now you can either use these. Like, for example, this. You can sample it by pressing R2. Well. See? But, uh, I guess just for this, I will pick... This. And I'll come over the menu and uh, saying adding a transition will shorten the overall overall project length. Continue. Then you want to go to the left and hit confirm. And it'll add a transition. So the little thing right there. Okay, and then you can watch your clip. See if you need to edit anymore. And then when you know it works, it'll come up with a little envelope. See that little, did you see that thing on that thing with the red circle? That made your recording. Just do whatever. Hello and welcome to the video. Okay, yeah. You get the point. Now, what you're wanting to do is you're gonna wanna hit the um share button. Not not the share button on this. No 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 no. Mm, where is it? Yeah, you don't wanna hit that again. You're done with that. But you're wanna gonna hit triangle. Just find triangle on your remote. Press it. And then it'll come up to this little thing right here, and, it's, and it says, Rendering Movie. Please wait. And basically, this just, basic, basically what it does is it downloads it to your gallery. And this takes as long as the video you make. So it could be anywhere from like a minute to maybe 50 minutes, I'm not sure. Well, yeah, I'm sure. Just, we can wait. It's at 60%. Because this that video that we made was only 56 seconds. Yeah, seconds. We can wait. We can look at my bed. Why does I say bedroom? Does this look like a bedroom to you guys? This is my main cave. The bedroom's across, across the hall. Okay, and it'll come, next it'll come up to this. See it? Yeah. And then you want you're gonna want to hit share on the left side, and then. It'll just do a little bit of loading. And then you're, most of you are going to go to YouTube. So you want to go right and right. And hit YouTube. Come on. It's 
uploading. Okay, so but most well, the first time you do this and some other times, you'll have to hit sign in. So hit sign in. It'll come up to this web page. What to do? Now you want to log into your email, which we did in the last video. So you want to go to take your email. Like, um, uh, you guys should know what I mean. Okay, and you're gonna write it, you're gonna move your cursor over to where it says enter your email and press the blank. So I'm gonna do that. Luckily for me, it auto recognizes my uh, email. Or, it basically memorized my email, so yeah, then you're gonna wanna press done. And you wanna go go down to next. I hit that. And then you're only gonna hit password. And fill that in. So yeah. Once you got your password in you just hit sign in. If I got it correct, I should have. Okay. Allow. Please wait. Okay, and and you can hit OK. You don't want to sign out yet. Okay, then you want to get a name. So you want to press the top line that says title. And you want to just hold down square for a little bit to X name. And I'm just going to name this something random since I'm doing this with one hand. Perfect, press R2, then you can skip all the rest of this because that doesn't really matter. And then you want to go to the very bottom and hit share. Then it'll add it to your uploads and then it'll start uploading. So yeah guys, this is how you do it. This is how I do it. So yeah, have fun. And you do not need PlayStation Plus. Remember that. Okay. Bye, guys.